Authorities have confirmed Walt Disney World was a potential target of a terrorist attack. But gunman Omar Mateen decided to carry out his attack at Orlando's Pulse nightclub instead. New 6 investigator Mike DeForest is live outside Walt Disney World. And Mike, Omar Mateen had considered attacking the Disney Spring shopping area there. Ginger, you may have actually heard reports before of Omar Mateen visiting Disney Springs and Disney World prior to the Pulse attack, but federal investigators now confirm he was considering another attack here, and they say his wife played a role in that decision. Noor Salman told investigators that she, her husband Omar Mateen, and their young son visited Walt Disney World last year simply as a family outing, according to CBS News. But now federal authorities say Mateen was considering an attack on the resort's Disney Springs entertainment area, formerly known as Downtown Disney. Mateen reportedly asked his wife, quote, what would make people more upset, an attack at Downtown Disney or at a nightclub? That's according to federal prosecutors who made the allegations yesterday in a California courtroom. The government claims Salman assisted her husband in planning the Pulse nightclub massacre. Salman's attorney insists she knew nothing about the plot that left 49 people dead. Since the Pulse shooting, the presence of outside law enforcement at Walt Disney World has surged. A new six investigation revealed that from 2011 to 2016, the Reedy Creek Improvement District budgeted about one and a half million dollars a year for off-duty Orange County Sheriff's deputies. This year, that funding has skyrocketed to $5.6 million. That's nearly quadruple what Disney's government spent on off-duty deputies prior to the Pulse attack. In a statement, Walt Disney World officials say, we work closely with state and local authorities and constantly review the very rigorous security measures we have in place. Those security measures include bomb sniffing dogs and what Disney calls less visible technology. Now, the company says all of their employees participate in what they call a community watch program, which means those employees are keeping an eye out for anything suspicious. Ginger. Frightening details, Mike, and we know that he did not attack Disney Springs. He went to Pulse instead. Any idea why he made that decision? Uh, federal prosecutors have not disclosed that, though, but those are details we may hear as Noor Salman's criminal case proceeds. Mike DeForest reporting live outside of Disney World tonight. Thank you, Mike.